السلام علیکم ورحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ میں پیس مرسی اینڈ بلیسنگ آف آل مائٹی اللہ بی آن آل آف یو دس از دا منتھ آف رمبان دا منتھ آف کمپیشن اینڈ فکیبنیس دا منتھ آف اسپرچل ریفلیکشن فلفلمنٹ اینڈ ری افرمنگ آف یور فیتھ تھرو پریئرز اینڈ سپلیکیشن دا منتھ آف ٹوٹل ایبسٹیننس فرام دا ورلڈ پلیئرز and the defiance of desire and the month of pure intention so move towards occupying your day and breath with the acts of obedience to allah subhanahu wa ta'ala as a normal practice during this month the muslim families get together and have their aftar meals that is the fast breaking meal in the night we observe fast from dawn to dusk The Muslim flock to the mosque to perform congregational prayers and also the night prayers called Tarawih in this holy month of Ramadan. Families get together, friends and relatives are invited and organizing of the parties in different hotels. and people are setting up tents outside to share food with the poor and needy people this year ramadan is totally different as we know the corona pandemic hit the globe badly every individual every country has been affected socially and economically in this month as you all know that we required to stay at home we need to adhere to the government and public health directives which is given to all the segment of the societies to maintain the social distance which means no iftar parties mosques are closed we cannot go to mosque to perform or congregational prayers no tent has been set up outside to share food with other people it's a total abstinence no social intermingling we are also required to stay home to follow the instruction of the government so that we should not participate in the further rise of the corona virus cases this is our duty to listen and obey the instruction given for the benefit of all the nationalities that are living here in this great country this is the month and this is the time especially when everybody is required to be well hydrated you drink a lot of waters but since this is the month of ramadan and we cannot drink water or we cannot eat healthy food during the certain hours from dawn to dusk we cannot so what is the advice the advice is to so the people who are of uh, elderly age they cannot fast they are exempted children are exempted a person who is sick especially the one who is suffering from the chronic diseases they need a medical attention they need to contact their doctors and they are exempted from fasting otherwise each and every healthy adult person fasting is compulsory and obligatory on him as long as he is maintaining a good health and in the previous year he fasted but we need to make sure that we need to eat healthy and balanced diet our diet should contain both micronutrients and macronutrients which means it should have fats carbohydrates proteins vitamin c iron etc during the non fasting hours we need to take enough of these food in order to keep our body fully hydrated since this is the lock down time we cannot go out with friends 
we cannot have a fire parties we cannot go to mosque so there is an alternative also lucky enough that during this month we are in the house we are not going out to work in in a heat and sun which will def definitely affect us make us thirsty and hungry more is good for us that we are inside the house inside the ac so we are getting less dehydrated there are certain thing that we can do in the house to make this ramazan an interesting one we can digitize our tradition for example we can talk to our uncle aunties brother and sister who are living in other emirates or outside the country by sharing our food recipes our daily routine works and things like that a parent can organize a quiz competition amongst the sibling or there can be a quran recitation competition and parent can make videos of their young ones when they are reciting the holy quran any particular surah or ayats or if there is a quiz competition so the parent can sit and throw a questions one by one and the children can answer the question and accordingly they can give them marks or prize or something like that so by this way after the school timing this kind of activities will keep us busy and children will also be getting children will also get some activities to perform in the house we can also make one ramadan corner in the house we can decorate it we can portray things over there which is related to ramadan like a prayer corner we can sit over there and pray we can sit and recite and we can hang and paste something there which is related to ramadan the suhoor the iftar the foods the dates and things like that so these sort of activities in the houses will keep children busy and they will also be Um, interested in performing these extra activities in the house at the end i would like to say a prayer a dua alhamdulillah alladhi afana mimma abtalaka bihi wa faddalana ala kathir mimman khalaqa tafdila may allah save us all and protect us against this calamity against this pandemic coronavirus stay home stay safe thank you very much